Hi, <clears throat> uh, I'm going to show you how to set up the failsafe uh, with the Dragon Link and the DJI NASA. Uh, first, you need to uh, put everything on uh, your transmitter, uh, the uh, Dragon Link, and also the model has to be on as usual. Uh, I'm going to turn on the um, uh, up here, just, just to show you that the FedSafe works. Um, uh, the point is that you uh, have to uh, um, uh, you have to set the FedSafe for while the transmitter and receiver is on, um, and you do it like this. First, you move the controls where you want them to be in a failsafe position uh, I just want the uh, throttle to be just above 50% so the model hovers and I'm also turning on the failsafe button the forced failsafe button which I have set up via the uh, mix uh, menu uh, and uh, now it is the way it should be when the failsafe uh, will uh, start and uh, what I do now is that I uh, hold the bind button in for 4 seconds I count 4 seconds 1, 2, 3, 4 What I can see in here that, uh, is that the receiver is uh, re-engaging and now it should be set So to check it out I uh, move the sticks to the ordinary position uh, go to the app to watch what happens here uh, There are two things that should happen the throttle will be just over 50% and the control mode switch will move to failsafe When I turn the transmitter off which means I lose the signal Okay As you can see it moved to failsafe and the throttle is uh, a little bit uh, over 50% which means this uh, model will uh, stop and return to home <coughs> you see it moved back and then it's back in GPS and this one is my button that I uh, switched the uh, three uh, the three control modes everything works thanks for watching